Hey, 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 this is the boat doctor. I watched the battery blank out on me again. Hey, anyway, just missing this. The storm is just about ready to hit. It was just starting to kick up with us coming in. Anyway, 2250, beautiful boat, boy. This takes some rough water, I'll tell you that. We uh, tra swap trailer. I noticed it pees off. It's a Pacific. Not Pacific, but a Pacific. A Pacific trailer. Ha! Huh. Top mount coupler, two end fall. Got a pin to lock it. I topped the brake fluid off. Got a round seven. Cables, that's good. They don't rust, but if they do see a little cracking on those, change them. That means the cables are starting to get rusty. Two speed Fulton. This thing loaded like a champ. That extra low speed's nice. They need a shackle. I lost one out there that was mine, and that one's mine, so I'm going to take that one back off. Got a Minnecota Tereva. Uh, manual deploy, probably a smart way to go since he's got the walk around anyway. <laughs> that way he doesn't have to worry about that gear, that self deploy up and down. He's got an anchor chain, it didn't see an anchor. And that's got the tilt down nest so that will drop your anchor really easy. Got big strakes, got your G3 tubing on here. Uh, got a few, just a little chips. Uh, this flares out so when the water comes up, it shoots it out that way. That's this arrow design. You can sit and just spin this. I'm going to have them drop that motor one hole. Uh, that way you'll even get more bite. And you got that reverse right there with that double, triple, they call it. Uh, reverse that air traps up underneath there and slows it down coming off of this sucker i'm down here with rock uh got lights front led lights and he did it the right way he got the sides led in the front six so it puts out a lot of light the horn the phantom radar sliding windows nitrous filled uh, hubs you can't really hear it here. Five bugs. Uh, just brakes on all four and I think they're ST215 14s. Uh, you got four four by four with or four two by sixes with slicks. Uh, he needs to up that these back bunks on this side. As you can see, they must have dropped or something. I don't know if he can. I'll mention that to him because you have nothing supporting on this back part. Transducers picked up really good. The live view works really good. This has got the Caterpillar power steering. It's really nice. You got your trim here, got the trim limiter, got the freshwater flush. This is the saltwater series, which they all are. 4.2 gear case, which will handle the stainless. <clears throat> Remember to uh, tape that off if you're just using earmuffs because these take a lot of water, okay? And you can get muffs. I checked all your drains, they're all sealed good. The underwater light work good. Just the right amount of trim tabs on here. And I showed you already the inside of the boat. There's your switches right there. When I was in there, I showed you, then I got the garment to work. I got all the electronics. They do need to tighten up that Yamaha puck because if that thing bounces, that can throw you off. So I had it set. Just hope it remains that way when they put the other screw in it. Let's look down here. It has the same thing on the bottom, but I don't know how he's gonna. You know, he's got a little adjustment there. He can slide them bunks up in the back. But anyway, and then the side's got some little scuffs on it right here. But a real nice boat, I'm telling you. Like I say, I went through the inside already, so this is just a quick outside. Uh, automatic trim, I set that for you. So all you have to do is hit it and it'll trim up by itself at different RPM levels. So there was a lot to this, this is a day and a half. I'm trying to get this thing lined up. All right, this boat doctor out. 2023, tuna tubes. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. If it's rough, this is the boat you want to be in, I'm telling you. This and the 2500. Now I even got myself a duck. Quack! Found him floating the other day. Alright, boat doctor out.